best stories of the week. All right, rapper Lil Wayne is in trouble, uh, you may know. He faces up to 10 years in federal prison uh, after pleading guilty on uh, federal or illegal gun possession. Now, it's worse for him, I guess he has a prior felony. So if you have an illegal gun on top of a prior felony, it doesn't matter if you're trying to commit a crime with it, because that is the crime, just having a gun. So here is a little legal strategy I would like to suggest to rapper Lil Wayne. It goes like this. Lil Wayne is one of the people who came out either pro-Trump, I don't remember if he was pro-Trump or just he was okay with Trump, but he got sort of labeled on that side, that unpopular side where he was kind of okay with Trump. I feel like he should get a pardon because I think you could make the case that anybody who's going to jail in our current environment who also was a supporter of Trump is not going to get a fair trial, right? How could anybody get a fair trial in the context of being a Trump supporter in this current time? Because we're watching Democrats uh, literally and publicly finding a variety of ways in which they say in public we're looking to punish anybody who supported Trump. We're actually looking to punish them for political opinion. Now, if I'm President Trump and I'm thinking, you know, maybe my odds of a second term are pretty low right now, and I knew that rapper Lil Wayne supported me, and I knew that his only crime was not an act, there was no actual crime. In other words, the crime was just having a gun. There was no intention, no, no allegation he was going to use it for something specific. So really, there was no victim. And in the context of nobody who supports the president should expect a fair trial. Is that a fair statement? Don't you think it's a completely reasonable statement to say that any notable figure who is notable for supporting Trump, they could not get a fair sentence or a fair trial in the United States in 2020? Isn't that a fair statement? I think that's completely fair. Now, it wouldn't be probably fair, it wouldn't be a strong enough statement to have, it, have the court overturn anything or for the court to reverse anything, but it's 100% strong enough for President Trump to pardon him. It's 100% strong enough for that. In fact, if you could show me a better reason for a pardon, I've never seen one. I've never seen one. I, I, will, I will hold up Rapper Lil Wayne, in my opinion, is the strongest case for a pardon, presidential pardon, I've ever seen. Now, I don't know if his crime is the kind that can be pardoned. I don't know if it's federal or it's state. So I don't know how that works. Maybe he can't be pardoned. But if he can be, I would. <laughs> 